Hi, I'm David Gross with Condi Systems, back with you to share a little bit of my wisdom for sublimation success. One of my favorite questions to be asked is, what's new with sublimation? Well, today we have a big what's new with sublimation. Today I'm here to introduce the next generation of sublimation printers. They look a little bit like the old ones, and that's because they're made from the same basic printer as the old ones, but this time with several very important changes. Number one is, I believe these are the first printers ever for the desktop, as far as I can remember, that are designed out of the box for sublimation. And that's because our friends at Sawgrass, the folks that make the ink, have partnered with Rico, and through our feedback with them, through the evolution of these printers, they've gotten with Rico, and they have asked Rico to make this printer for Sawgrass. So if you look on them, you'll see that they bear the Sawgrass name. And that's a good thing for a couple of reasons. One is, it makes our community of support between us and Sawgrass tighter. No longer do we need to go to Rico uh, when we're having problems, mechanical problems or whatever with the printer warranty issues. So it really makes a great family relationship to help you be successful with these printers. Number two is, when Sawgrass got with Rico, uh, they made changes to the printers to improve the print quality. Sort of like a, a mid-year model improvement on a car to make it have a smoother ride, update the technology in the car, things like that. Next is, uh, Sawgrass went back to the drawing board and formulated a brand new ink. And that ink they called the Sublajet HD ink the HD ink, and of course that's an acronym that we're familiar with, high definition. And so this new ink is a expanded color gamut ink. It has even a brighter, more vivid color spectrum. Um, it has, it's loaded with even more dye that makes it what it does, the sublimation process. And so I have spent the last uh, couple of months with these printers and I'm very, very impressed with the incremental improvements to the mechanisms themselves. I'm Im impressed with the ink, um, and, and so I think these printers will take what we're already in, a viral sublimation market, and cause it to go straight up. Now, a couple things that I have fun doing is I've blinged my printers, if, if you'll notice. Now, the, the printer really doesn't come with this, this bezel on the front, but I couldn't resist because you know you got so excited. So what I wanted to do was I wanted to sublimate to the printer. And so for Condi clients that buy their printers from us, I'll include the Sublarap uh, decal template already pre-cut for you to bling your printer. And we're going to be running a contest on the, the Condi, uh, Condi website under the Condi client gallery of what people are doing with their printer, and so it's very exciting. So if you get your printer from Condi, for, for while the quantities last, I'll provide you one of these for you to decorate and bling your own printer, so it's very exciting. The new series, by the way, is called the Virtuoso series from Sawgrass. So this is the SG400, this is the SG800, and they have the same capabilities as is in the past. For this printer out of the box, it will do up to eight and a half by 14. If you add the bypass tray, we now have a new paper that's eight and a half by 21, and, and we're trying to allow this printer to do socks. So, so still pushing the, lim the envelope a little bit there, but we're trying so that the entry level cost of, of doing some of these large products like socks are achievable. Um, so, so still at it. On this printer, same capabilities. Out of the box, it does 11 by 17. If you add the bypass tray, um, it does 13 by 21. And of course, we have a bunch of paper sizes that are appropriate for substrates like the, the device cover inserts, mug papers, you name it. So what we're trying to do is practice what I call Kaizen, which simply means we make small incremental improvements, and if you make hundreds or even thousands, guess what? You've got a great value. What I'd like you to do now is watch the tour setup videos for each of these printers, whichever one uh, you may have purchased, whichever one you're interested in, and I'm going to take you through 
all the details of getting the most value out of this printer so we can help you on the road to sublimation success. Till we meet again, this is David Gross. Thank you.